<laughs> no, no, no. So charge your life. <laughs> yeah. It's beautiful. <laughs> Have you ever had a teacher put their hands on you like that? Yeah. <laughs> This looks like one of those public bikes. Yeah. <laughs> that, that is the cutest thing I've ever seen. We call that cop dog. Is wait, so the dog itself is famous? Yeah. Or just that general kind of dog? I think that that kind of dog. Because it's too like so small we can squeeze it in a cup, so we call it <laughs> cup. Dog. Wait, say it in Chinese. Cha bei chuan. Cha bei chuan. <laughs> Cup dog. I like it. That's really cute. You almost would be worried as an owner. Step on it? Yeah, I mean, it's tiny. Or you open the door too fast and it's behind. It's like... But, you know, if you keep it in a cup and you put it in your pocket, <laughs> I guess that's what you're supposed to do. Hold it all the time. Mm. I forget what we call these things, but I know a few. That's really cute. Yes. We probably can do that. That's a no. She's I'm pretty sure good. I can do that. I mean, we can practice. <laughs> <laughs> well, I got a few things to say about this. One, do you know any of these? Are these like common to learn as a child? Uh, I know some. Uh, I a lot of people know it, but. As, as I grow up, I just forget them. Well, yeah, of course. Like, I, I would forget how to do them, too. But when you were younger, everybody did this. Yeah, I didn't know a lot. And so when other kids know how to do that, I was like, damn. <laughs> you, you were in the corner, <laughs> like. Yeah, I want to learn. But it's, uh, I will, I'll be like, where did that learn that? Because at that time, we don't have a lot of internet. Well, of course. I mean, you know, internet's a modern, a very, very modern thing. What I was trying to get at was the one-child policy. Hmm. We play with our neighbor. So you, you could play with your neighbor. And cousins. And cousins. <laughs> but no brothers or sisters to sort of like, here, play. We Oh, patty cake. We call this playing patty cake. I, I don't know if that's correct. but That's, that's the only it. one? No. There were, oh, the ones off the top of my, like, Miss Mary Mac. Oh, okay. So you have, when you, they when have you a play, different, yeah. you actually have, like, a, a rhyme. Yes. And you you sing along. Right, and they're not doing that here in the video. They're following the music. Is that how it goes in China? There's no rhyme. With no, it? this one has has become popular recently. Mm. I've seen this uh, a few times, but when I was younger, we didn't have this. Okay. Something different, but this one's really cute. I have one other thing to say <laughs> about, <laughs> and it's. The shape of this guy's, oh my God. the shape of his head. Let's talk really, really quickly about this cultural phenomenon mm -hmm. in China. <laughs> <laughs> because this is pretty desired. The flatter the back of your head. That's, in the um, older people things like that. Mm -hmm. And I, I, I don't think that's very desirable. You would okay. say now currently. My opinion. No, not you, because you are definitely not a standard <laughs> yeah, it, Chinese no. person. And my head is, <laughs> <laughs> is flat too. Mm -hmm. My mom used to be very proud how, how <laughs> she like uh, sat me when, when, when I'm sleeping as a baby. Let's talk about this. <laughs> so in order to achieve this shape, because it's not totally natural, is to some older people will like put books under under baby's head like mm -hmm. to flatten it like when they're laying down yeah and then sometimes uh like babies sleep whatever they they'll move their head when they yeah. sleep and then when when um uh, their parents see it or grandparents see it they will move their head straight and like we gotta be careful about this because we can't. and over time <laughs> this is so this is the 
This is the culmination of a lot of hard work <laughs> from grandma and mom. I used to get the comments, like really like, good comments. Whoa. Like, wow, her head is you like... You did a good job. <laughs> you done good. <laughs> Dang it. So very desirable and somewhat traditional. Yeah, but also I think... That's how older people, older generation thinks mm. that what they do to their head, mm. like, uh, like that's what they do, and their head looks like that, like that's the result. Mm. But in my opinion, it's just like generation is like gene in the genes. Like sure, if, I mean if, if you continue your, doing it at some point, if your parents has like flat head, and you're you, more like you're more like yeah. flat head. Yeah, it, it's doesn't <laughs> it's not the like sleeping the, uh, this way or that way like mm. make your head looks like that mm. so now I, and this is totally unrelated or at least i think it is but i went to a museum once and mm. i saw like a chinese old ancient pillow and it was like this hard ceramic like a glazed ceramic pillow. We used to have that. Was it? Is it kind of was were that was that related in any way or just that that was the shape of? Um, we do have those kind of pillow. Uh, I think sometimes they put like uh Chinese medicine in there. It's actually good for your health. No, oh. it's like traditional Chinese medicine. Yes, which works. That yeah. stuff is real. And also like um. In in summer we didn't used to have uh, AC, mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. and that kind of material is is um, cooler. Right, and even like bamboo mats to ba put under yeah. in the summer to keep like your bed sheets and mattress from overheating in the yeah. summer. That's still like pretty standard. Yeah. Very uncomfortable in my opinion. Mm, very All right. hard. I had to say it. I'm sorry. It's a little bit of a <laughs> sore spot for Lena. You know? <laughs> but I had to bring it up because this guy is just the picture of perfect, perfect uh, shape. Very cute. How old do you think she is? Five. Can you do a Rubik's Cube? No. What do you call this in Chinese? Morpha. It's like magic cube. Magic cube. I kind of like it. What's it say on his blindfold? Blindfolds are the best in China. Um, it says genius. <laughs> Alright, here we go. He is genius. Yeah, I mean, this is... It doesn't look like he's solving it, though. No, he just remembered. He remembered. You gotta be kidding me. He's rebuilding oh. this cube. Oh my gosh. It that is... is that is unreal. Well, How do you do that? <laughs> it took him like amazing. 30 seconds to look at every part of the cube and then he put it down, puts his genius blindfold on and just <laughs> recreates it without looking. Well, he, he deserved he, yeah. that title. <laughs> yeah. What are some other ones that you've seen? Like on, on um, what are they called? Uh, the eye masks, the blindfolds? Anything. They put, they put a lot of They're really of creative. Yeah. yeah. So if you're in a dormitory, if you're going to college, they might bunk you up with four or six people in a room. Uh, my college, we had like eight people in a dormitory. And there's no separate rooms. All, They're just bunks. Yeah, they all stay. bunk beds. Four bunk beds. We actually Was have... it a quad bunk? Like someone was on the fourth one? No. Okay. Just like one against another. Okay. So we actually have, uh, we have four bunk beds. Inside your dormitory, right? Yeah. No bathroom. Bathrooms are communal at the, bathroom at the end of the hall. Bathroom is public. Right. And so if somebody's staying up working or studying, which is very common, yeah. like you have to just slap one of those on and try and get to sleep. I trying to be very creative, <laughs> like to trying to get a, as much privacy as possible. Mm. So I like put, put up a curtain Okay. on my, on my uh, bunk beds. You can do that if you've got the bottom bunk. No, you I can. live actually on, on you top. You have the top bunk? Yeah, but I, I do like a string mm -hmm. from tight, tied up like two ends. Mm. And then I put a curtain there. Mm. That's how I shut myself up. <laughs> I, the first time I With went into my... a dorm room, 
in China. I couldn't believe the living conditions. But you really learn to like get along and like you become very close to these people because you have to like coexist. You're living on top of each other. Best.